Hi guys, James from MeasureSquare here. Welcome to the Estimating Settings tutorial in the MeasureSquare 8 Advanced Topics series. In this video, we will cover max T-seams per room, cut margins, max roll cut length, minimum reusable length, roll cut option, roll cut roundup, and linear length roundup. To begin, make sure a room with a roll good in it is selected. Then go up to the Estimating Setting gear located in the top center. Click the gear to modify the number of T-seams the program will be allowed to use when setting up a default layout in a room. If you want to modify the number of T-seams the program will be allowed to use when setting up a default layout in a room, select Max T-seams. Note that you can adjust the number of T-seams manually as needed. This will just adjust the amount of product added in as a default. To adjust the amount of product added as a margin to each cut in a room, click on the gear and select Cut Margin and type in the dimension, such as 3 inches, 5 inches, etc. To determine where this margin will be applied, select the margin type and choose from the options None, Length Only, Width Only, and Length and Width. Note the changes to product quantity and the roll cuts when these changes are made. Please note the user must click outside of the menu for any of these estimating settings changes to take effect. To adjust the longest roll cut the system will be allowed to make, the user can type in a specific dimension in the max roll cut length field, for example, 25 feet. See the changes take place accordingly in the roll cut view. To adjust the size of a reusable remnant on a roll, go to the min reusable length field and type in the value, for example, say 3 feet. Note that the unused value on the roll changes accordingly. To adjust roll cuts by tab, go to the roll cut option menu and select by tab. This will group all of the roll cuts on a roll by the tab they are on. So multiple tab projects don't mix and match cuts per roll. To adjust the roll cuts by room, go to the Roll Cut Options menu and select By Room. This will group cuts on the same roll to within the same room. Roll Cut Roundup will allow us to set the roll cuts to a specific length, say every 3 or 6 inches, giving us a more realistic cut list for our roll goods. Watch the roll cuts change from say 19 feet 1 inch to 19 feet 3 inch when we make this change. Lastly, if we would like to round up our overall linear length for a roll good, say from our current measurement of 294 feet 9 inches to whole feet, we can go to the Linear Length Roundup field and type in 1 foot. This will round up our total linear quantity for this product to 295 feet.